Good morning, Internet. I thought I would take a walk and walk and talk this morning. You know, it's a beautiful day outside, and I wanted to see how well I, the um, image stabilization works on this camera. Because I haven't tried walking and talking with this, and this is a lot easier to do than what I was doing for my uh, cell phone before. Basically, all I have to do is operate the camera left-handed, which, since I'm ambidextrous, that's actually not very hard for me to do. Um, actually, I'm just walking to the bank at the moment. I need to go deposit a check. Uh, I hate dealing with banks. <laughs> well, this is technically a credit union, but still. Oh, that's weird. There's somebody driving slowly on by. I wonder if that's any, my new neighbor. <laughs> so, it is quite a beautiful spring day here in Madison. Hi. Hello. Uh, let's see. I believe our high today is 17 Celsius, that is. Uh, Fahrenheit, that's 60... 62-ish? Not sure. Um, when I do conversions between Fahrenheit and Celsius, I just kind of guess. It's kind of become instinctual. Oh, uh, let's see. Let me get a good view of what I'm walking through, and you can see why I consider this a nice spring day. We still don't exactly have too many, uh leaves on trees outside of the evergreens, but it's starting. We'll probably be in full bloom in a couple of weeks, would be my guess. You can already see some buds on the trees now. It's a little windy. I also wanted to see how well the wind cancellation works, because that will tell me how well I can do recordings outside. Absolutely beautiful day. I love the neighborhood that I live in. Once the once there's enough leaves on the trees, there's basically canopies over all of the roads here. It's awesome. I mean, there's a lot of trees in South Florida where I grew up, although a huge number of them were knocked down in the last set of hurricanes, so there's not too many very tall trees anymore other than Malaluka's. But, um, there's not really any roads in South Florida that have canopies. I should probably... There we go. Now I can see myself again. Yeah, there's not really any roads that have canopies, like what you see up north. I don't think there's any particular reason why, just they don't seem to exist. As a result, I really like roads that have large, beautiful canopies as you walk on by, especially if the canopy also covers the sidewalk. Because so then I'm walking in the shade, and just looking up and seeing beautiful trees, it's quite nice. Well, let's see. This is the first real spring day in my mind. I'm actually wearing short sleeve t-shirt and shorts. It's a little on the cool side for that for most people. I think it's currently around 12 outside with fairly decent wind. Pretty sure you Floridians would probably want to wear a sweater even when it's 17, but whatever. Uh, what else to talk about? I'm going to cut through a couple of parks here. It's actually a, a marginally quicker route. I only cross the road that way I wouldn't run into a family out on a stroll. I don't think they want to be recorded. Just a hunch. So, this is actually my second attempt at recording this. The first one, which I did on the day I had my orthodontist appointment, it ended up starting to rain, so I couldn't really continue it. It's unfortunate. Oh, let's see. What all's been going on? Oh, and yeah, I should show you some of the parks. So, we have a couple of small parks around here. I apologize if I'm spinning too fast. I'm not used to using this camera outdoors, so I don't know how fast is C6 speed. But um, this actually runs into a second park. This neighborhood has a large number of small parks, which is great because it basically makes a green belt inside of the neighborhood. And well, I like green. Not to mention that parks don't exactly stop me from walking through them, unlike houses. So this means that for some places around here, it's actually faster for me to walk than most people to drive since they have to drive all the way around a lot of these parks. Whereas I can just cut through them. Quite nice. Oh. Uh, my plans today include, well, depositing the check that I'm about to go deposit at a credit union. 
this is not actually my credit union, but there's an affiliation between this credit union and a whole bunch of others, including mine. So I can use this credit union for most basic banking stuff without actually going to my own, which is good because my own is not within walking distance of here. Uh, deposit a check, come back. Maybe take a second walk over to do some grocery shopping. I don't actually have to go grocery shopping this week for once. I should, because then I will have fresh foods in the house and such. I could probably switch back to, well, well let's go cut through another park. Because I can. Green Tree is actually the neighborhood I live in, Madison, so there's a lot of things called Green Tree around here. I don't even know how well these show up because of how bright it is outside. Well, let's go ahead and switch back to facing again. Hello again. So, what was I talking about? So, yeah, potentially going grocery shopping because while I'm not out of things, I could go grocery shopping tomorrow or Monday or... Tuesday, I think Wednesday is about the latest I can pull off. Past that, I'd be out of breakfast. Um, it's really nice outside today, so today is probably a really good day to take a walk. After that, if I have any time... Or after that, I have a gathering of co-workers, not an official gathering or anything like that, just us wanting to have a good time type of thing. Um, I'll probably be going to that... And if there's any time in between, I'll probably continue Beyond the Beyond. Do some more Let's Plays. Weird echoing of dogs. I don't know if you all can hear that. Probably. I don't know, it might count as noise cancellation. This camera is really good at noise cancellation. I have to remember to stretch my arm a bit more. My arms have really low, uh, I have really low upper body strength in general, so I'm actually getting tired from holding this very light camera. This camera's almost as light as my cell phone. <laughs> Seriously, arms. You've got to get stronger than this. Hmm. Not sure what else to talk about. I'm probably going to stop this in this park. Uh, this is the larger end of the park. Hello! Yeah, I'm one of those people that say hi to everybody. So sue me. So, you probably haven't been able to see much behind my head. So let me go ahead and pivot and move the screen where I can see what I'm doing. This is Green Tree Park. It butts up against the Prairie Restoration Lands, which I used to live across the street from. So yeah, I really don't live very far away from where I used to live. It's absolutely, I wouldn't say beautiful park, but very nice park. For beauty, maybe at some point I'll actually do this. I'll go take a walk through the University of Wisconsin Arboretum. That is absolutely beautiful, especially very beginning of summer slash end of spring where there's leaves on everything, but it's not super hot outside. It's very nice. But, alas, it was not to be. And yeah, not exactly a small park. Um, what you see off in the distance, kind of where you see a ridge with trees on it, that's actually another park. That's a more major park. That's Elver Park. I used to live at the intersection of Elver Park and the Prairie Restoration Lands. I don't know if you can see it. There's sort of a pond up ahead. It's kind of a duck pond. I see a lot of ducks. Maybe that's just trash. Um, the Prairie Restoration Land is actually an old landfill. You, if you walk around on top of it, you'll actually see the, uh, what do you call it, um, uh, I can't think of the, methane, there we go. You'll actually see in the methane vents, and along with a solar-powered pump to make sure that they don't explode. Apparently that's actually happened here before. And that's really about it. I can't stretch my arms far enough. 
Oh, well that would explain it, I was zoomed in. Have I really been zoomed in this entire time? I don't mean just for this video. I haven't messed with the zoom for quite some time, which means I've probably been zoomed in for all of my vlogs. Boy. Well, have a nice day, internet. I'll upload this when I get back home. Bye.